it's a river, right? And, and a river has, um, and this one in particular, has a thousand creeks and streams that all feed into it. So if you wanted to just talk about it from a hydrological standpoint, you know, how do you build a wall that is going to traverse creeks and streams? I mean, it's, it's pretty ludicrous just from an engineering standpoint. And I'm sure, you know, some Halliburton or some, you know, big defense contractor could find some really fabulous way to gouge all of our eyes out and pay for it, but it'll fail uh, spectacularly uh, if it doesn't have the same ingredients that can accomplish the same thing, um, which are uh, these, these uh, you know, the, the, the visibility. You need to have uh, visibility. You need to have accessibility to the river. You need to have the technology and the personnel and if you did it with a virtual wall and a road, you would add to that the fifth ingredient of mobility, an issue that we on the border, uh, especially here in Laredo, uh, hold near and dear to our hearts, which is the ability to, to move and, and get from A to B um, along, you know, along this wonderful, beautiful um, uh, river that does in fact unite us because it's our common source of drinking water.